In this video, we will learn about the fabrication of Adams class. I will be showing the fabrication of Adams class on tooth number 26. You will need a plier, 22 gauge wire, and a marker. Take a 22 gauge wire of around 10 cm in length. The first step in fabrication of Adams class is straightening of wire. As you see, the wire is almost straightened. Now, on the cast, on tooth number 26, hold the wire perpendicular to the long axis of the tooth and we have to mark the distance between medial undercut and the distal undercut so that a bridge will form. Now, on the wire at the point which we have marked give a 90 degree bend same on the other side we have to do 90 degree bend to take care that after giving both the bands both the wires should be in the same plane after giving a 90 degree band bend the wire more so that it becomes an acute angle this acute band is given so that the arrowheads will be placed properly after every single step, checking the fabrication on the cast is very important. Now the next step is, we have to mark the length of arrowheads. Now with the help of rounded peak of universal plier, we have to give slight 90 degree bend and for giving a complete 360 arrowhead bend, hold the plier on a bridge and apply the pressure. Now compress the arrowhead using both the bricks. Follow the same step on the other side. This is how the arrowheads look like. Check it on the cast. Now we have to bend the arrowheads towards the tooth surface. This is how you should hold the arrowheads. You can see how the arrowhead is being bent. Similarly, do on the other arrowhead. Hold the arrowhead between the beaks. We just have to push it backwards. Let's check it on the cast. Yes, we are going good. Now, the most important step, we have to give a million dollar band. Mark a point on the free arm of arrowhead just below the breech.
just look at this how i have hold the wire with my plier i'm going to give a million dollar bend first push it backwards like this and now downwards you have completed with the million dollar bend similarly on the other side push it back first now downwards we completed a million dollar bend on the both sides let's check it on the cost after this the next step is mark a point to give an occlusal bend for giving the occlusal bend hold the plier on the point of occlusal bend in such a way that it is perpendicular to the bridge you can see how i am giving the bend you can check the occlusal bend how it is adapted now mark the point to give the palatal bends After giving the palatal bend, first of all, cut the excess wire. Making of pegam. at the free ends is the final step of the procedure but i prefer it to do after giving a palatal bend hold the wire at the tip of the round beak we just have to roll the wire around the round beak just apply the pressure and now make the pegam small holding it between both the beaks similar on the other free end Now the remaining part is the palatal adaptation. Do the markings for palatal adaptation. Just keep a slight bend with the round peak.
check it. Our Adams glass will be ready. This is how it looks from the palatal occlusion and the buckle.